The Kuwait dive team do most of their work underwater, using scuba to salvage sunken boats and take care of environmental problems that we cannot solve on land. But the pollution the dive team cleans up in the sea originates on land. Not everyone can be a diver or has the time to dedicate to learning the skill that it requires to lift boats and cut sharks free of discarded fishing nets. But everyone can help in the Kuwait dive team's efforts to make our world a cleaner and more environmentally friendly one. Through the Mobile Beach Cleanup Unit, the Kuwait dive team engages all sectors of society in their work. The supply truck travels to Kuwait's many coasts, where groups of volunteers from schools, businesses, and organizations gather to clean waste left on the beach by picnickers or washed up by currents. The dive team provides training and equipment for volunteers ranging from university students to municipal workers to CEOs. Each Tuesday, the Kuwait dive team partners with the Ministry of Education to bring 100 Kuwaiti school children to a downtown beach for an educational morning of fun learning about and caring for marine ecosystems. Students are greeted by the colorful cleanup truck. They take a photo with their teachers and dive team members and then head inside to a cafe whose space is donated to the team's efforts for these events. A dive team member gives a lesson about oceanography and marine biology. Students learn that whales weigh as much as 40 elephants, that our planet is 70% ocean, and that turtles eat jellyfish, which sadly look like plastic bags when floating in the water. Armed with knowledge and a greater appreciation for the life under the sea, depending on them to keep the earth clean, students head to the beach and spend half an hour picking up harmful plastics, random shoes, and occasionally even the odd tire. To help boost the stocks threatened by pollution and overfishing, students then help the dive team release fish donated by the local scientific center into open water. To learn more about the team's work underwater, students play a friendly competition to free model animals captured in an abandoned fishing net. And their day ends with a snack and a certificate thanking them for their environmental efforts. All students are sent home with one of the dive team's junior divers coloring books, full of information and reminders about how to care for the sea, because our oceans are everyone's responsibility. <laughs>